Now let's dial it back a bit and talk with the members of the Dutch group Klangstof. Hello, fellas. Hey, hey man. How's it going? Welcome to Coachella. Thank you. It's pretty nice, right? It's hot and really nice, yeah. Amazing. Have you been out here before? First time. First time. Welcome. So tell us more about you. As I mentioned, you know, uh, festivals are so much about music discovery for people. And, and for me, that's what I look forward to is just stumbling across my next favorite band. So tell us uh, your background. All right. Yeah, so we're just, uh, I, we're the first ever Dutch band to actually play Coachella. So that's, Shut up. That's pretty cool. That can't yeah. be true. It's true. Really? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. And um, well, we, we started out uh, only two or three years back. And um, making some kind of, I lived in Norway for, for six or seven years, kind of complete isolation, no one around. So you got really depressed. I got really yeah. depressed, made really sad music, <laughs> and now I'm here in the sunshine. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. So describe the music a bit more, and um, how much music do you have out so far? So I'm, my biggest inspiration was Radiohead, so it's kind of somewhere along that road. Uh -huh. um, at the same time, you know, Scandinavia also has a very distinct sound, like bands like Sigur Ross and yeah. kind of the soundscape-y, drony things, which I really like. So I think we're very um, kind of riding very kind of dynamic uh, indie rock. I like that. Oh, yeah. yeah. Dynamic indie rock. <laughs> and, you know, from uh, where you live, uh, are, are you familiar with festivals like, like Coachella? Is it, I, I mean, don't... Did you know Co about Coachella it? Coachella is pretty legendary. It's legendary. Yeah, it, like uh, other festivals around around the states that we're we're going to now, like I haven't necessarily heard of, but when I hear of it, I know know like oh, it's huge stuff. Yeah. But but Coachella in Europe is is major. And so how how do the festivals differ from from European festivals that you might go to? Uh, we have longer shorts. You know? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that style? Yeah, 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 yeah. I've seen that. <laughs> All right, but essentially the same. Yeah, yeah, less boobs and butts in Europe. But I do, I do think it's more, maybe US festivals are a bit more mainstream. Like you said, uh -huh. kind of going to discover new artists uh -huh. might be a bit harder in, on festivals like Coachella, mm -hmm. like Glastonbury has 20 of those small stages with all the bands that you know just started out sure. and uh, getting a chance. And Coachella is, is very much about the big influential acts coming every year. Sure. So I'm also, I never thought we would be able to play here this year, you know? Yeah, exciting. Yeah. So if uh, you could tell our audience one song of yours, uh, you got to pick one that they should go listen to right now. What is it? It's a song called Hostage, definitely. Hostage is the one. All right. Langstoff, thank you for joining us backstage at Coachella. Have fun while you're here. Thank you, yes. <laughs> Appreciate it. Good to see you.